There it is. There it is. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. There it is. It's gone. It's gone. Let me show it's going off. Let's go! We still make our limit. This one's head shaking pretty bad. What's going on guys? Welcome back. Had a little uh, audio issue with just this one clip. That's the only clip that had an audio issue. But we were baiting up. We got a little rough surf today. They got some fresh samples that I bought from uh, Gulf Breeze Bait and Tackle. I didn't really feel like catching them because it was cold out. Do want to get wet. So I don't like getting, you know, wet when it's cold outside. But I'm putting fresh samples on the hook. Tipping it with the brand new fish gum. What I've noticed about this fish gum was since I used it in the past couple days I've been out fishing. That the fish gum is lasting a lot longer and stays on the hook so much better. I'm enjoying it a lot. And as you can see, we're fishing a rough surf. So I always like to fish rougher surf, yeah. south, south winds during the pop and run in springtime. It seems like we turn on the bite almost every time. So find a deep hole, cast out, and let's get the fishing guys. Let's get after it. There you go, come on. You wanna get it? Fish on guys, fish on. Let's keep, don't, just keep on reeling. Don't we're like bow up and it's real real. He's like popping, he's moving left and right. There you go. My buddy Chad on the Papano. We think it's a Papano. Is he doing a lot of head shakes? I don't feel anything. He was there. I felt him. No, it's on. It's just... They hit that other You good? Just keep on, keep on walking the back. I right, come over here. Keep on reeling. Keep on reeling. Walk over that, walk over that rod. There he is. That's a Papano, baby. Let's go. On this. All right, let's stop right. Let's go over it. Let's go. That's one. Yep. Heck yeah, that's a legal one too. This as we were talking about moving. Yeah. What is that? Oh, that's my chair thing. Oh, chairs fell down and everything. First popping of the day. Finally, I didn't even see it hit. Mr. Chas saw it hit. Look at that beautiful fish. Let's go. I got a cord we can put them in. You put that one back in the rod holder. I'm gonna get these lines set again. So that bite was on the frisky purple and white rig. Samplies of fish gum. Gonna put the same combination out there. Let's see if we can get another one. I got two small sand fleas right here and that's gonna uh, put on one hook just because they're so small get my sand off my hands tighten the drag up just a hair let's get it back out there got a rip current pretty much right here and see where the waves are breaking away out there on that bar we got a really deep hole right in the right off the beach right here and hopefully it pans out to some fish in the cooler wouldn't mind taking a couple home <laughs> all right That's Let's go! I just put this one out. Oh, that's a good fish too. Oh yeah, he's pulling hard. Don't let the wave monster get him. Constant tension. Bite's definitely picking up. For sure. Oh man. Let's go. Oh yeah, he's fighting pretty good. Ooh, look at him head shakes. Please be a popping up. You see him yet? 
I don't even see him. I don't see him. Oh, he's right here. He's on the beach. That's popping up. That's a nice one, too. Yes, sir. Oh, my gosh. Stud. Oh, yeah. I didn't even get a chance to put another rod up. The bike's been, oh, my God. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. Look at this guy. Let's go. It's a freaking tank. Oh, my gosh. Y'all, you don't know how big this popping is right here. Look how wide he is. Oh, yeah. That's a beauty. Well, I just ripped his gills, so. Look at this thing. Oh, yeah. That's a stud. Let's go. I'm going to put him on the camera real quick. You put samples on your rod? Okay. I didn't get a chance to bait this one up. I'm trying to bait it up. And this tank, absolutely tank, just hit, guys. Look at this thing. Freaking massive. Big pompano. Let's get a measurement on him. Huh? I'm getting around portrait mode. Oh, six, 15 and a half to the fork. Yeah, nice it's one. probably three and a half pound pompano. Right. Hell yeah, good job. That's a freaking stud. Let me rinse my hands out and get these baits back out. Whew, pandemonium, guys, pandemonium. Uh, I think I dropped my fleas. So I'm out to go. Huh? Oh, yeah, for sure. That's what I try to tell people when I take a Papano fishing. Is that you want, you're going to see that vibration. You're going to know it's a Papano. Yeah, man. It's like, it's like this. Mm -hmm. Let's get this fly back out and get these rods out quick as we can. There you go. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. This real. Is he on? All right. Heck yeah. We all them, boys. We are all them. I haven't stopped recording yet. Let's freaking go. There you go. Get him in. Get him in. Why are you doing that? I, I'm waiting to get him in. I was going to get a bait out. Let's go. All right. When he gets close to the surf, start slowly walking back. So you keep that tension on him. I got <laughs> double up, double up. <laughs> now I think you might be on. Now I'm on. Now hold on, stop, 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 stop. We just tangled up. Oh, yeah, we just tangled up. Same fish. Yeah. I lift your rod tip up. I'm just gonna go around. It's all good. I got excited. Let me see that bad boy. You already pop his gills? Yeah. That's a good fish. He's legal too. Put him in the cooler. Oh, shit. <laughs> leaking blood. It's all right. It's good to get bloody. Look, this is how quick we got out of our chairs and a pop and no hit. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That's just the win. Trying to hurry up and get these rods out. Getting a little impatient. I need to slow down. That's just how it happens when we get in a hot bite. It's like that every time. Got these sand fleas from Goldbreeze Bait and Tackle. Shout out to the cashier. He hooked it up. I appreciate you. Or the cashier or the, the associate working there. I don't want to say cashier. Who says that? And I'm using the new fish gum as well. Huh? Yeah, right there should be fine. Let's go, baby. We got me pumped up. Love it when it gets together like that. Just catching fish in general makes me happy. Ain't no better feeling than catching fish. So, rig I'm using this. The Frisky Fins Rattle Rig is the rig I'm using. Sand flea, new fish gum. And that's the rig of choice right now. Get the sand off my hands. Get the sand off my hands. Let's wheel them in. Fix my Frisky Fins 5 ounce weight today. It's definitely a five ounce day. These waves are big, but I had a feeling with these rough conditions, the pop should be in here chewing. We got three. Can't get can't complain. Definitely blessed to catch those fish. But the wind is howling. Just had a front row through. I might be rolling through now. Getting these lines out. So we can catch a fish. Pick it up yet. Wait till he hits again. He didn't get the hook on that one. No, no, no. That, 
I know, I did 100% solid hit. He just didn't get it. Let's let it sit for a little bit. Then I'll, I'll rebate it here in a second. But he hit it and didn't get hooked. Yeah. That's all it was. Wait though, he'll be back. Okay. Come on. There it is. There. Get, 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 get. Real, real, real. This real. There you go. One second. Stop. All right. That drag is too, too loose. Sometimes too tight. You still there? Yeah. Let's go. We're on, guys. Hopefully, it's pop number four. I told you we'll be back. Let's go, baby. Keep that tension on him. Why wow, watch these other rods just in case? Come on, real, real. Yes, another pop. Let's go. Bring him up. Let's go, baby. That's a good one. It's a hot spot here on this end. Let's put that back in the rod holder. Claim your fish. This is pop number four. Number three for you, right? Yeah. yeah, heck yeah, let's go. Good fish. Pop his gills, put him in the cooler. All right, we're tightening this one. Their rod going out. So, setup I am using today. Of course, I'm using Deerfield Spike as always. Big shout out to Deerfield, a huge supporter of the channel. Also, Ninja Dagger, big supporter of the channel. This is their 11 foot. I got two 12 foot, 11 foot, all paired with a Kuma uh, Flight Surf Reel. They're 12K, but they're a small, smaller 12K. Perfect for surf fishing. Big enough to catch the Papano and big enough to handle any shark pretty much you can cast off the beach. Well, I'll put that to the test this uh, this summer for sure. But this 11 foot with a five ounce weight absolutely slings with Taz line braid, 30 pound braid. Boom, baby. Let's get another one. All right. So I'll change the battery up and we ended up doubling up on Papano. Two at the same time. Look at this. Two. I, I, oh, oh, oh. oh, you want to eat it? Let's go. I was just about to go up to the truck and grab my lunch. And this one just hit. This is like a good one. I think that's the first run. That, that rod is the first time you got hit, too. No, this is the first pop oh. one we caught. I caught, we caught that big one, and you caught your first one on it. Oh, okay. Let's go. Oh, come on, come on. He's rushing the beach. Running the beach. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go. There he is. Number 10. Two more for a two man limit. These are the schoolie popping on right here that, that are for the run. These guys right here, it's the fish that everybody's after. Right here. This right here is popping on number 10. Thought I just saw another hit. Put him in the bucket. These are the fish everybody's after right here. Uh oh. Let's go. Is this going to make our limit? This one's head shaking pretty bad. Oh, oh, let's go. He's in the surf. He's in the surf. There he is. He's coming up. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Popping on top of the water. Papa Low number 12. I did it. I did. 
All right, guys, this is Papano. Ouch. Papano number 12 of the day. That is our two man limit. This is uh, the last fish of the day. I'm gonna keep him, put him in the cooler. Falls out of my hands, but that's it for today's video. We absolutely warm out today. Kind of slowed down a little bit midday. But we're gonna pack up and get out of here. See you guys next time.